What's up guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to convert your widescreen video to make it look a lot better in IGTV vertical format. For the first part, I'm not actually going to change any of my settings. When you upload a 1080p widescreen video to IGTV, Instagram actually crops it for you. So you don't even need to worry about having to change the settings or anything like that. All I'm worried about is making sure the subject on my cinematic is in the middle of the screen and will fit a vertical format. So the first thing I'm going to do is go up here to view and go to overlays, uh, show horizon, and this will bring up some nice guidelines. So we have the center here and then these two small ones on the inside are pretty much where the sides of the vertical format are. So what I'm going to do is just go through each clip separately and click the transform tool here and just move my subject into the center and in between these two markers. So that's that one done. We'll go to the next one, position this like that. This also creates a good opportunity for some like artificial panning and keyframing, which is quite cool. So on this one, what I'm gonna do is select my video clip, uh, enable the transform tool, make sure my markers at the beginning of the video clip and just press the keyframe button and then go to the end and kind of like track the subject of the video. So I want these feet in the middle. So I've added like an artificial uh, pan basically, which is, which is quite cool. And it's gonna make sure that my video, when it's in vertical mode, there's constantly something going on in the frame, which is, which is really cool. Now to export it, all I do is just go up here to the export uh, share bar and go to Apple devices, 1080p, settings, video codec, H.264, better quality. And just, I'll export it exactly like that. I normally just airdrop that video clip to my phone to upload to Instagram and then Instagram will uh, crop the video for me and I haven't had any issues with quality uh, when doing that. And the other tip I was going to give is to rotate your videos that you've already edited so that you can watch them on widescreen on IGTV. So I'm just going to open up one of my videos here in QuickTime and I'm going to go up here to edit and you can either do rotate left or rotate right, depending on which way you want it, but it doesn't really matter. And then what that's gonna do is flip your video into this vertical mode. And then you just wanna go ahead and click the cross and it will let you save a new version of that in vertical mode. So we'll just save that to my desktop. And then once I've done that, I will also send that via AirDrop to my phone so that I can upload it to IGTV. You'll be able to turn your phone and watch it in the widescreen mode. I also have quite a cool app that I use to do this on my phone. It's called RFV. And what that basically does is allows you to rotate your video clips and then upload them exactly the same as what I just did in QuickTime. So yeah, those are my top tips to converting your widescreen video uh, to vertical for IGTV. If you do want to get into IGTV and start just uploading to IGTV, I'd highly recommend learning to shoot in vertical format because when you're editing, it's just going to make it a lot simpler. When you bring your footage into Final Cut Pro, Final Cut Pro will automatically create a vertical project for you. And um, yeah, it will just be a lot better workflow in my opinion. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.